Hey, what's up? How's it going? Today we're gonna go over how to draw a fiery cat head. I think it's really cute slash Halloween-ish. So <laughs> scary. Uh, it's gonna be real easy, simple, and for beginners, okay? It's gonna be really cute as well. Uh, I'm gonna be using this Crayola brand marker. You guys pretty much donated to get this and some other stuff for the channel, like editing equipment. Thank you so much for the donations. If you wanna donate to keep this channel essentially running for the three to four months that it's active, <laughs> uh, then d go to below and it's gonna have my PayPal address and that's usually where all donations go to like the stuff I need to edit this stuff uh, and improving the channel. But thank you so much. Like I said, this is a seasonal channel. Let's jump into this already. Let's jump in, easy. So kitty, fire kitty, uh, let's do this. I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna draw kind of the lower portion of the face. So I'm gonna draw like a straight line down straight underneath and then pull up right on so you got the lower part of the kitty's head don't forget to subscribe by the way i'm going to be posting every single day until halloween and then uh, i think when it starts to get deep into the possibly halloween season maybe september or maybe the beginning of october uh, i'm going to start posting two to three times a day um just to be more active and i just to finish everything i want to finish as far as the requests go um all right let's keep going here but like I said, you gotta press subscribe and click that bell notification. Uh, I believe only, I think it says like 98% of, of you are not subscribed. Oh man. Pulling up, down for that head. Over here about the same. So we got that cool shape right there. And here's, that's for one ear. Let's try to copy that shape as close as we can for that other ear. Pull across. Right on. And now we're gonna draw the fire part, right? So we're gonna go over here. Curve for one cat eye. Do the other one over here, just kind of copy that. It's just like an upside down U, that's all it is. And over here, and draw the bottom side. Cat eyes are open. Tiny nose in the middle. It's basically an upside down triangle, okay? Tiny. Make it tiny and close to the face. This sort of make, it looks really cute. Go over here to the mouth. One side. Go over here to the other one. Other side. Okay. And now what we're going to do is we are going to draw a tongue over here. There you go, tongue, straight line, curved line underneath that. Good so far? Let's draw the whiskers. Well, let's draw some dots right here first. Three dots, three dots. And we're gonna draw some whisker madness here. Just three lines. Right on. So let's draw the fire part. So I'm gonna go to the eyes and I'm gonna use a much thinner line right here. And what I'm gonna do is maybe rough around this point of the eye, I'm going to draw a wavy shape, line in, another wavy shape, pull that line back, downward right here, pull it back here, and maybe one more here, and then we're gonna go right into the eye, right on, so that, kind of that fire eye kind of look, over here, in, same thing, wavy shape. Back, the, obviously this isn't an exact science, you know, but like this wavy shape is really just kind of an up and down shape essentially, right? Out over here, out over here. All right, we got that kind of like, I don't know, maybe magical cat eye. And I'm gonna draw over here what I forgot to do, which is I'm gonna do the inside of the ear for the cat. Okay, we're doing good, we're doing good. So what we're gonna do here and draw now, now we're drawing that, now we're gonna draw the cat body. Shoulder down here, shoulder down here. So we're gonna go straight down, straight down, right? And what we're gonna do here is we're gonna draw a line over here and a line over here. 
and we're going to draw the paw shape, which is basically a square. Right on. Line below. One, two for the paws. One, two for the other paw. And we're going to draw the legs sticking out the side, because usually cats... Uh, sorry, I spit on my paper a little bit like I was yapping. I was talking here. Um, so we're going to draw... You can pick one side or the other, but I'm going to pick the left side here, and I'm going to draw the back of the cat's body. The little legs squish there. Okay. And then from here, when I go to the, the keister meester, I am going to go up around here for the tail. You see that? And then back over here. We're going to go in there. That's it, the foot. All righty. And what I want to do here is I'm going to add a little bit more because I think this flame is a much bigger. I'm going to add a little wavy flame at the end of that. Like the flames are just coming off here. Just to kind of even that out a little bit. I might even throw a little tiny one here to make it look like the same design pattern. But with this magical fire cat going on, I, 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 I'm going to make this just completely leave it blank because I think it kind of looks cool that way. Um, what else could I add to this? You could add little, uh, little circles at the top here, maybe like little sizzle lines or something. I mean, it, looks, it makes it look more like magic. You're like, what's going on? Ooh. Or you could also thicken out those eye lines here just a bit, not too much, to kind of really uh, throw emphasis on it. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. Thank you so much, by the way. This is pretty much the end of the lesson. Uh, that is the end. Uh, do me a huge favor and share this. Sharing is caring when you share, uh, you know, a lot of cool things happen. Basically, it brings back this cool spirit of Halloween and it, you know, makes the algorithm better and it grows the channel for the three months of the year as usual. Uh, I really appreciate it. Everybody's been super amazingly nice. I have a lot of returning people, but like I said, 95% of you, if not more, are not subscribed. So hit the subscribe button uh, and share the video if you enjoyed it and get more others to, to do that. Thank you so much. I will see you later, uh, and I need you to basically say hi to me if you can hear this right now. Say hi in the comments, and I'm going to reply to every single comment, okay? Stay spooky, guys.